creating an immature plant batch. The look and options you see in Metric may vary depending on the state you are operating Metric in, but the functionality of the software is the same. Therefore, the demo you will see in this video may look different from what you will see in your license, and may involve a few different steps. But the functionality of creating an immature plant batch in Metric will be the same. To enter an immature planting, you will need to already have strains set up in your license. There are three ways to create an immature planting in Metric. The first two start from the plants area, which we are currently in. The first way is to create a planting by simply clicking on the Create Plantings button from the Immature tab. This is the least favored way, because when you create a planting this way, you don't have a source of the planting identified. This can be used for special circumstances along with state approval. Otherwise, you should always have a source of the planting identified. You can see on the right side of the screen the origin package and origin plant columns reporting the sources for the immature lots. To create a planting this way, click on the Create Plantings button. Enter the group name, plants type, plants count, the strain, the planting date, and then click on the Create Plantings button. We will talk about these steps in a little more depth when we demo the next way to create a planting. The second way to create a planting is from a mother plant. To do this, we will navigate to the Vegetative Plants tab. An example of this type of planting would be taking trimmings from a mother plant and then planting those trimmings as clones. You could also take seeds from a plant in the flowering phase if the plant was allowed to produce seeds and make your plantings from there. Here, we will select the mother plant we are going to take the clones from. Once highlighted, click on the Create Plantings button and the mother plant will be recorded under the origin plant column for the immature planting once created. Here is the pop-up for the new planting. The mother plant is auto-populated with the mother plant we identified. Next, assign a group name for the planting consisting of the strain name and the date of the planting at a minimum. You may add more if you wish, but strain name and date of the planting are the minimum. Type in the strain name and date. Next, assign the plant type. In this case, we are planting clones, so select clones. Then, designate the plant count, or how many plants are in the planting. We are taking three trimmings from the mother plant, and will plant those as clones in our planting. Next, identify the strain of the planting. Click on the magnifying glass to look up and select the strain. Then click on the Select button. Designate the planting date. We're creating our planting today, so we select the Today button. Then click on the Create Planting button to create the planting. However, we are going to create our planting in today's demo by using the third way to create an immature planting, which is to create a planting from a package. So, cancel out of this. Navigate to the Packages area, and then go to the Active Packages tab. Here, we will create an immature planting from a package of immature plants. First, highlight the package we are going to pull the plants from. Then, click on the Create Plantings button. Assign a group name consisting of the strain name and the date the planting is created at a minimum. Next, designate clones as the plant type by selecting clones in the drop-down. Then enter the plant count. In this example, we are going to pull three clones from the package for our planting. Designate the strain, and if you need to check the strain of the package you are pulling from, you may hover over the magnifying glass for the origin package. Then, select the strain by entering it or using the strain magnifying glass. Select the strain from the drop-down, and click Select. Then, assign the planting date and unpackage date of the package. For this example, they are the same, so select today for both. 
Finally, click on the Create Plantings button to create our immature plantings from a package. And we can find our planting by going to Plants and then opening the Immature tab. And there is the planting we just created.